Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Back to the Future the game for more point and click adventure game action. We are right back where we left off, still in 1931, trying to find a way to convince Officer Parker to arrest Kid Tannen. Um, I'm not really sure what we've got to do, to be honest. for a haircut now, even if they were Oh yeah, it's closed, that's a good besides, point. Besides, they'd probably cut it too short. <laughs> uh, what do we have in our invent? We've got Artie's pipe, haven't we? Uh, did we try using that with Einstein? I think we did, didn't we? And we didn't really get anywhere. We've got a photo of George McFly, an empty chloroform bottle, a scratch sheet, the lighter, and Artie's pipe. Um... Yeah, we're, um... Well, I'm a little bit lost. If I'm honest. We've got to find something to convince Edna, Parker to arrest Kid. Um... What was that? Can I have a copy of your song? I think I could have a copy of your You Should Care lyrics. I've uh, got a club of my own that could really use some inspiring. Sure. Let me just get a page out of the hymnal. There hymnal. you are. Hey, thanks. Oh, I wonder if we've got to use that in... in the place. Uh, the... See ya. Speakeasy. Keep fighting the good fight. Let's see. Let's go over there and try it. Uh, let's... Oh, can we go back in or did we get kicked out? I can't even remember. It's been a while since I played the game. A couple of days, so... Uh, there was the blood, wasn't there? I guess there? that's Grandpa's nose blood. Alright, yeah, so... Can we just head back inside? I guess maybe we've got to use that sheet and switch it with... Welcome back, sir. Trixie's one? It's the only thing I can really think of at this stage, but I don't see how that's going to convince Parker. Don't know, let's try. Looks like Parker's still parked. Yeah, it definitely seems that way. Yeah, because there's this I don't care lyrics here. Can we switch these with these? Hey Trixie, look over there! Why? Right, we can. Didn't you see it? No. Ah, uh, never mind. Not really sure what the point of doing that was, to be honest. To you should care. Oh, can we get her to do uh, that? Trixie? Yeah. Uh, okay. I know what happened to Artie. I talked to Kid. Oh? He told me about Artie. Oh. It was awesome of you to plead for his life. And it was uh, awesome of Kid to spare <laughs> it. So you see why I gotta get rid of all the dirt I got on Kid. As long as he's loyal to me. I gotta stay loyal to him. Right, so can we make him not loyal? Um, turn on Tannen. Okay, so Kid spared Artie's life, but that doesn't make him a saint. Believe me, no one knows that better than me. But if Kid can let Artie off the hook, I guess I can let him off the hook. Know what I mean? Not really. Um, about Arthur? About Artie McFly. What about him? Have you heard from him? Is he okay? Uh... He's okay, oh, I guess. Yes, he's okay. Are you sure? Believe no. me, if he wasn't okay, I'd be the first to know. Uh, do you take requests? You know what you'd sing great? This one song by... Pick it up with the piano player. He does the set list. Okay. Break a leg out there. Thanks. So, can we... No, that's the wrong... The wrong button again. Can we put this into here? I think I'll hold on to these lyrics for posterity. No. Hey. Okay, cue ball. Back off, kid. I'm trying to entertain some people here. Okay, can we do anything with this stuff? What have we got here? You should care? Should we try that one? Maybe that will, like, spark him into action. You should care what people think of you. She's right. I can turn my life around. Okay. Sure you, you know what? I used to be a good cop. And yeah, I've had a few bad breaks. Possibly even a psychotic one that caused me to imagine a disappearing space car. But I'm a good man. Yeah. Exactly. And all I need to do to win Betty back is be the same good man I always was. And let the chips fall where they may. All right. So Excellent. now what? Arrest him. Wait. Wait for the moment to take down Kid Tannen, restore my good name, and win back the heart of Betty Lipinski. 
Hold that thought. I bet that moment is just around the corner. Is it literally around the corner? As in kids around the corner upstairs, or...? Boss? Oh no, there he is. You mind? I'm trying to have a good time here. I think you'll want to see this. Are you is that crazy? Dynamite? Bringing a stick of dynamite into my club? That's just it, boss. It's all over the place. I think our speakeasy arsonist is getting Ooh. ready to strike again. Gonna set fire to this place, are they? The size of that gun is ridiculous, isn't it? Oh! There's a secret passage. Can we do that? Don't think so. So there's a secret passage behind there then. Hmm. You in? Yeah, can you do whatever kid did, please? Bet on 723 and 723 and 30. Hmm. It's gotta be some sort of trick to this, right? There we go. Well, we know where he went then. I wonder where this leads. Well, that was easy. Okay, so I guess we're... What the hell? It brings us out the barbers? That's weird. Uh, so... Well, where did he go? That's the question. Uh, maybe... Edna saw something? Dunno, should we head over here? Let's ask her if she saw anything, I guess. Uh, Edna. Edna. What? Did you see anything? Parker's reformed. I'll be happy to know that your lyrics have pushed Danny Parker back on the straight and narrow. Well, hallelujah. One poor soul saved from the fiery pit. <laughs> oh my days. Right, um... Bring kid to justice. Couldn't kid be brought up on other charges like, say, running a speakeasy? In a perfect world, yes. But no one in town seems to care about prohibition anymore. The feds are only interested because of the lost tax revenue. Alright, okay. So it doesn't look like she's seen... Unless she's broken, broken a story. Tonight? Only the usual. Mayor Thomas trying to slink out of the speakeasy. Frankie Needles crashing his car into a fire hydrant. Nothing that'll get uh, we've me already heard page. this before, I think, haven't we? Uh, okay. See ya. Keep fighting what the good fight. What about the dock up in the the inn or whatever it is? The hotel up there, Majestic Arms Inn. That's it. Um, has he seen anything? Did he see Kid come out? Maybe. I guess if he was looking out of the window, he might have seen where Kid went. Hey, Doc, I can use a little help. What's the problem? Uh, Trixie's park is fixed. Good That's news, good. Doc. Parker's ready to arrest Tannen, and it looks like I didn't go stag to the prom. Wonderful. What about Miss Trotter? I'm still working on her. Yeah, that's going to be a problem, actually, isn't it? We still haven't figured that out. Uh, have you seen Why Kid? Why are Tannen's always such jerks, anyway? Uh, it's hard to say. Rogue, Neanderthal genes in their DNA, perhaps. Um, yeah, okay. so it's not like he get knows anything. History. Be careful, Marty. Hmm, okay. So he didn't see him. Where else can we go? That's the question. Uh, Lamont's house of Ermin. Sleep tight, little Ermins. So can we go back through... It's closed for the night. Luckily, I don't have a burning need for a greeting card. No, so we can't go through there. Let's try going back to the speakeasy then. There's got to be somewhere where he went, right? Why has it changed the camera angle to that? Cabbage crates. There's literally nothing there. It's a puddle of blood. There's nothing in there. Hmm. Where did he go? He went through that secret passage. And then he came out the barber shop, Welcome obviously. Back, where the sir. hell did he go after that? What's it going to take to get Trixie to squeal on Kid? Yeah, I wonder. Um, hey, take a any ideas, squirt. man? 
You won't even talk to us. Yeah, what is it going to take? Uh, Trixie? Yeah? Um, turn on okay, Tannen, so come kid's on. kid spared Artie's life, but that doesn't make him a saint. Believe me, no one knows that better than me. But if kid can let Artie off the hook, I guess I can let him off the hook. Know what I mean? Okay, um, about Arthur. About Artie McFly. What about him? Have you heard from him? Is he okay? Uh, no, he's not. I think something bad might have happened to him. What? You mean Kid went back on his promise? Uh, yeah, uh, that's right. Oh, no. Oh, poor Artie. Maybe this will work. Poor sweet little Artie. I know. That rattlesnake kid. He can't get away right, with this. I think this. it's going to work. You're going to turn over the evidence you got against him? Am I ever? Just watch me. Wait a minute. What evidence do you have that kid bumped Artie off? Um, it's just a hunch. Keep your hunches for the racetrack. It ain't right. Nice so we need evidence that he's killed him. Unsubstantiated rumors. Okay, about the it wall looks of like fame. They put a new picture on the wall of fame. Oh, jeez, kid. Who'd you bump off this time? Oh. Who's that supposed to be, Mickey Rooney? I don't huh. think so. I wonder if there's a way we can use that. Break a leg out there. Thanks. Can we get? The artist guy to draw a picture of. Hey, what? Artie or something? Uh, about the caricatures. So everyone in the Wall of Fame are enemies of Kid Tannen that have coincidentally been killed? Enemies, rivals, guys who looked at Trixie the wrong way. Yeah. Okay, what are you drawing? What are you working on now? Boris Karloff. What do you think? Not bad. Uh, okay, what happened in the alley? You know what happened to Trixie out there? She seems pretty freaked out. You talk weird, you know that? But no, I don't know nothing about Trixie's emotional state. Kid doesn't pay me nearly oh, enough just had to an pour idea. drinks and babysit his crazy girlfriends. Hang on. Talk to you later. Hey, look, a paying customer. Shut up. We've got that picture, haven't we? We looked at it earlier. I wonder if we can use this. And get him to you do this. Draw a picture of this guy. Sure. Yeah, because it looks like Artie, hey, doesn't it? That looks like that Artie McFly think. Yes. Hmm, I never noticed that before. Hey. Uh, right there we go. A hat like Artie wears. Hopefully, it's going to look exactly like Voila. Artie when he's done it. Spot. Nice job. Yes, now we figured it out. Chumps at the New Yorker. Right. So can we put this up on the wall now? The only problem is our ones there. Not a pretty bunch. Can we replace it? Yeah, Sorry we can, I think. This, there you go. It looks like Artie, doesn't it? Now, I bet if we go back to Trixie and we say that that's the evidence, I wonder if this will work. Uh, Trixie? Yeah? Uh, okay, look who made the Wall of Fame. I it's going to work. I don't know how to tell you this, but I think you should check out the Wall of Fame. Why? What is it? I don't believe it. We had a deal. Artie was supposed to be safe. I don't know what to say. Well, I do. Felony tax evasion. What? Before he died, Artie was teaching me about all sorts of stuff. Literature, history, accounting. And uh -huh. I made a big discovery while I was copying all of kids' books. This establishment ain't entirely on the up and up. Really? Oh, I knew about all the gangster stuff. That kind of thing you expect from tough guys like Kid. But when I found out he ain't been paying taxes on his speakeasy profits, well, well cheating there Uncle we go. Sam is one step over the line. Once I turn this over to the police, they'll throw the book at him. This book? Hey, Copper! Convenient time for Parker to be here, really, isn't it? Oh, I'm getting the feeling something bad's going to happen here. wonder if one of these two is going to get shot. Maybe Trixie? I hope I'm wrong. Okay, there we go. To my I think we've done it. I don't know. Rats. I told the chief we need a team of bloodhounds like they got over in Placerville. Yeah, but in the meantime... Oh, so he's gone. All right, everyone. Party's over. Everyone out of the speakeasy. 
Speak easy. You're mistaken, officer. This is an ice cream park. <laughs> Kids ice cream. Nice try you. Out. So we've closed it down. But how the hell are we gonna find Kid? He snuck out through that little What are you waving at? Matches. Would the Valenti mob be willing to help uh defuse this little situation? Uh, yeah, why not? Sure, no problem. I'll bring it up in the next uh, company meeting. Hey, we ain't begging here. Kid just thought JJ might like a piece of the action. Especially now that he's just caught the speakeasy arsonist. Wait, has he? Mean, Doc? Oh, uh, no. You ain't with the Valenti gang at all, are you? What do you know about the arsonist? You mind your own business. You. Off to the station house. Kid's gonna get you, rat. He's gonna get all of you. Yeah, yeah. Right, so where well, the hell is Kid that's gone? That. Thanks to Miss Trotter's evidence, the entire Hill Valley police force is out looking for Kid and his goons. You don't understand. We've got to find him now. He's captured a friend of mine. Who? Uh, escaped prisoner Carl Sagan, the judge's time traveling son. Uh, let's uh, go for this never one. Never mind. Don't oh. worry. We've got the entire town square sealed off. If Tannen's within a mile of here, we'll find him eventually. Well, I hope so. I don't think we have time for eventually. Uh, okay, what have we got here? Why is Aini here? And these barrels, this is Parker new. must have confiscated this hooch from the speakeasy. Ah, I see. Uh, Einstein, any hey ideas, boy, man? how you doing? Good dog. Apparently not. Something about this isn't there. Uber 28. A chicken in every pot. Uh, anything else? There's the police car. There's Parker. Is there anything over here? There's a trash can. What's this flask? Irving Kid Tannen. Guess he dropped <gasps> this on his way out. Just it's have empty. a quick drink of that. Figures. Oh, it's empty. <laughs> I wonder if we can use that of Einstein. Seeing as he's conveniently placed here all of a sudden let's hey, see Ivy, get your nose over here <laughs> looks like it all right i knew there was Cannon something behind Doc there herbert hoover Einie. okay okay i'll check it out i knew it a button a button hidden behind the poster all right doc here i come Oh, he's got Leon. Edna. What are you doing here? Wait, uh, Edna's the arsonist? Never mind. Come here and help me get rid of this stinking arsonist. Edna? I caught her planting dynamite while he was clearing out the soup kitchen. No way. Because Sagan was innocent after all. I was researching a story, you ignoramus. Tell it to St. Peter's sister. Hey, what's all this? Parker? Tannen, you're under arrest. Get him, Sacramento boy. I can't do that, kid. What? Oh, I get it. Why don't you let go yeah, of you got played, mate. call it a night? Hey, look over there! Oh, come on, who falls for that? Watch out! Wow, okay. Turns out he's got a really powerful gun there. Give it up, Tannen. The alley's blocked off and so are the roads out of town. It's over. Over? So Nothing over, man. is over until Kid Tannen says it's over. Okay, here we go. What do we do? Uh, we've got barrels, kitten, and gap. He's not about to let me in. So we can't go to the gap. Parker, any ideas? You have a gun? Not a real one. Beats me. Huh, that's helpful. Uh, there's the barrels, there's the trash cans. Right, so we go to the trash cans. Now there's Kid Tannen. Hey, moron! Moron this! Right, so we can't talk to him. Can't go to the gap. He's not about to let me in. Uh, what else can we do? Go to the barrels, I guess. Can we? No. He's not about to let me in. Do we have anything we can use? Can we like use that on him? No one messes with. I don't think he wants to smoke right now. 
Okay, can we lob the flask at his head? Watch your flashback, Tannen. Come again. Ah. Oh, Come on, we dropped kid. it. You know, yo, Tannen. Make like a tree and die, rat. What the hell? Oh, did he shoot you it? Shouldn't it be? Are you shoot? Leaky Clown. barrel. Has Marty now got Guybrush invent or something? Uh, what is the deal with this? Gooch is leaking all over the place. I'd better be careful with this stuff. If Doc can turn it into rocket fuel, who knows what'll happen if it gets into that dynamite? Right. Okay. Can we? He's not about to let me in. Uh, can we go back? Can we talk to Parker or something for an idea? Oh, Make she's opening the doors. Tannin. Tannin's never. What should I do? It's me. Oh, you're helpful, aren't you, man? I can't reach them from over here. Right, let's get to the trash cans. Is there a way we can get to that door to help Edna? Doesn't look like it. Right, okay, it's got to have to be something to do with this barrel, isn't it? Can we use the barrel on Kid? Bowling for ten. Oh, can we set that on fire or something? We can, you know. We've got a lighter. No one messes with Kid Tannen. Right, hey, let's try lighting idea, it. But not while Edna's in there. Right, not while Edna's in there. How are we going to get Edna Kid, out? Lead, phony. Not like that. Come on, um, kid. You know how this will end. Can we do yeah, anything to the gap? Uh. So we can't. We can't use that, can we? Hey, this there's is an idea. Not while Edna's not in while there. Edna's in there. Uh. How do we? At me? Are you shooting at me? Can we talk to Parker? Parker, man, how are we going to get Edna out of here? What should I do? It's me. Oh, you're really helpful, aren't you? Hey, kid, eat lead, phony. Oh, I see. She's. Hey, Mora, does she come out Mora if we speak this. to him and distract him? She does. Right, so do we have to keep Make making like him look this way? Die, rat. Hey! Had a girl. Make it easy on yourself, Tannen. Oh, okay, I think we've got to get, get over there quick and light this stuff. Um, otherwise, I think he might shoot her. I don't know if there's a time limit to this. Hey, kid! Here we go. Ah. That ain't a real gun. Oh, right. Nope. I forgot. But we'll set this on fire. It then. Oh. oh crap. Here we go. Hey, he's getting away. Oh no. Oh what? He's escaped. He's meant to get arrested, isn't he? Hmm. Yes. No. There. Good as new. Oh look, Tannen, the judge's son. Uh oh. All right, Parker. I want a getaway car and a clear road to Nevada, or the brown kid gets it. Doc. Marty. Doc. Yes, it's me. I'm talking to you through the radio apparatus my younger self has installed in the rocket car. What's going How on? How can there? Emmett not hear not that? Good, Doc. Trixie and Parker did their part, but now Kid's holding you hostage. Right, Scott. No kidding. Try to get Kid in the car. Once he's inside, give me a signal, and I'll do the rest. How am I? You! Oh, yes, Emmett. Well done. Emmett! Oh, no! You're the cause of all of this, ain't you? Oh, thank goodness for that. He's held known. on. What? Right, let's dodge. Uh, what can we do here? What's this harness thing? Dodge left. What can we actually click on? Where do we get this knife from, anyway? Dodge right. What's this harness? Hey! Ah, we got him! Doc, hit it. 
See you later, kid. Wow. <laughs> Into the manure again. Irving Tannen, I'm placing you under arrest for kidnapping, attempted murder, tax evasion, and smelling like a piece of crap. <laughs> tax evasion? <laughs> Haven't you heard? The feds are practically drooling over Trixie's books. Trixie? Yeah. Unlucky, mate. Oh! What you get for killing Artie, you bastard? What? I didn't... Oh, about that. Uh, did we All screw right, things Grandpa. up? My poor car. I believe I owe you an apology, Mr. Brown. Thanks to your ridiculous contraption, Hill Valley's most notorious Trixie criminal isn't is finally headed to prison. Marty's grandma, is it? Apologies necessary, Miss Strickland. Is My she? rocket car may have accidentally saved the day, but only because it's a completely out of control failure. I need a new idea. If you're willing to listen, oh, you're going to come up with a good a idea, Emmett. Don't you worry First, about that. I think we should take in a movie. I'm all yours, Mr. Brown. I think you'll like it. It's all about a brilliant wow. scientist okay. with an overabundance so of So Emmett humus. and Edna were a thing. Whew. Wow, on, there honey. we go. We'll find Doc. <gasps> okay, I guess we got to find Doc then. Thanks for letting me fly the DeLorean, Doc. Oh, we saved the day again. <laughs> sure that Second time normal. in this series. Totally. Kids going to jail, Emmett's going to see Frankenstein, and there's no such thing Let's as just hope we didn't screw something else up, okay? And we remembered Einstein this time, too. Hill Valley crime rate at all time low. Hmm. Well, except for Grandpa necking with Trixie, I think we're ready to go back to 1986. Oh. Do you feel yourself fading out of existence? No. Then as long as your father's still born in seven years, I say... Let your grandfather sow his oats. Sowing oats? Is that what's going on with you and Edna? <laughs> what are you talking about? Emmett and Edna. They're going to go see Frankenstein oh, together. Oh, no. That's he didn't go with Edna. Hard. Oh, no. Does that mean he never becomes a scientist? We've changed Doc's future now. Have we screwed Doc's future? Oh man. We screwed up again. <laughs> Oh, we're going to have to go back to 1931 again. Whoops. Dog's go, gone. Doc? Relax. We've got everything under control. Doc? What the hell? Hill Valley, we have everything under control. Why is Doc like some weird... So he's not a scientist now, what is he? He looks completely different for a start. I'm guessing we completely changed him by making it so him and Edna got together. Oh man, so many screw ups. Here we go then, let's see a little bit of a sneak Martin peek of fly. next time. Okay, Doc, let's see what kind of nightmare alternate timeline I've landed in this time. Father George, Mother Lorraine. Hill Valley under Citizen Brown is not quite the contented town you were led to believe Citizen it was. Brown? Re-education program? What the hell? Please don't swear, Martin. It makes me uncomfortable. Zero demerits until this morning. We're through, McFly. I'll never date such a square again. My own girlfriend thinks I'm a square? The obvious question, Mr. McFly, is what happened to you? Jesus Christ, Doc, what happened to you? Ooh. He's completely different. 
Well, there we go, guys. Something to look forward to in the next one. Um, we've completely screwed up again. <laughs> that is going to do it for episode two, then. Um, we'll click straight on. Click. We'll get straight on with episode three in the next one and see what happens next. But yeah, geez, that um, that really. Well, I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. But that is going to do it for this one. So, as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.